immunity. Immunity describes a state of having sufficient biological defenses to avoid infection, disease or other unwanted biological invasion that is the capacity of the body to resist harmful microbes from entering the body. Immunity is divided into two types innate immunity and adaptive immunity. Adaptive immunity is further divided into natural immunity and artificial immunity. Natural immunity is again divided into passive immunity, maternal, active immunity, injection. Artificial immunity is again divided into passive immunity, antibody transfer, and active immunity, immunization. Innate immunity. It is the natural resistance with which a person is born. It provides resistance through several physical, chemical and cellular approaches. 1. Physical barriers Skin, mucus, coating of epithelium lining the respiratory, gastrointestinal and urinogenital tracts help in trapping microbes entering the body. 2. Physiological barrier Acid in the stomach, saliva in the mouth, tears from eyes, all prevent microbial growth. 3. Cellular barriers WBC in blood, macrophages in tissues destroy microbes by phagocytosis, cell eating. 4. Cytokine barriers Virus-infected cells secrete proteins called interferons, which protect non-infected cells from further viral infection. Through these approaches, innate immunity can prevent the colonization, entry and spread of microbes. Adaptive immunity. It is of two types, naturally acquired immunity and artificially acquired immunity. Naturally acquired immunity occurs through contact with disease-causing agents when the contact was not deliberate. Artificially acquired immunity develops only through deliberate actions such as vaccination. Both natural and artificial immunity can be divided into two types depending on whether immunity is induced in the host or passively transferred from an immune host. Passive immunity is acquired through transfer of antibodies from one immune host and is short-lived usually lasts only a few months. Active immunity is induced in the host itself by antigen and lasts much longer, sometimes lifelong. Naturally acquired passive immunity Maternal passive immunity is a type of naturally acquired passive immunity and refers to antibody-mediated immunity conveyed to fetus by its mother during pregnancy. Maternal antibodies are passed through placenta to the fetus. This occurs around the third month of gestation. Passive immunity is also provided through the transfer of antibodies found in breast milk the yellowish fluid called colostrum secreted by mother during initial days of lactation has abundant antibodies that are transferred to the gut of the infant protecting against bacterial infection until the newborn can synthesize its own antibodies.